Hi peeps, uh, welcome back to the uh, Montgomery Trust. Uh, we are on our way to uh, Spain uh, to then get to the Pyrenees uh, later this afternoon. Uh, I'm joined by two um, wonderful gentlemen. Uh, on my left flank is David, yeah. and on my right is another young man, James. Uh, James is a professional teacher by background, but he's also, uh, I would say, uh, a historian of Roman archaeology and is writing his fourth guidebook. Yes. And when you consider he's 82 with arthritis and he's still climbing mountains, wow, <laughs> wow. And he's with his colleague, David, um, who's an aviation specialist in aerodynamics. Egg. From egg. Egg. Well, yeah. uh, still a specialist, an engineer. And what's fascinating in many ways is these guys have known each other since age nine, is that right? Yes. For 73 years? Yeah. And they're still mates. <laughs> wow, age nine, and here they are on, a, on another adventure and something uh, we've been talking about lots of uh, issues in society and what the Montgomery Trust is doing from their own experiences, especially as a teacher and uh, David said something I think really profound from Voltaire, yes. do you mind just for the youngsters today, Not at all. recite yeah. to that, would you mind? Quotation of Voltaire, oh god I've forgotten the beginning of it, ah I do, not, I do not approve of what you say, but I will defend to the death your right to say it. Yeah. I do not approve of what you say, but I will defend to the death your right to say it. Yeah. Can you then, again for the youngsters, can you remember that story you told me about the 14 year old in your school? Yes, I can. Uh, we had had uh, a, a child revolution in the school where the uh, the boys had taken over the comprehensive uh, for a couple of days and then order was restored but the head recognised that uh, perhaps he needed to do something in order to reassert any real authority and he went round to all the tutor groups, groups of 30 boys each uh, in order to explain how uh, they, the authorities knew that perhaps things needed to change a bit and they would be introducing uh, changes that might address uh, the problems. The, uh, when he finished his speech, one of the boys in my tutor group got up slowly, observably uh, shivering almost, but got up and said, you wouldn't have said anything like that if we hadn't have had this revolution. Isn't that amazing? Yes, it is. And, and that is almost like Voltaire. <laughs> yeah. And that's, what encourage, yes. that's exactly what we're encouraging with youngsters today. Don't be fearful. Don't be fearful of authority. Be honest to yourselves. Be authentic. Be elegant in the way you communicate. Follow your dreams and don't let anyone say no. <laughs> Keep going. Love is patient. Love is kind. We rejoice in the truth and not the wrongdoing. Yes. And, and I wish yeah. you gentlemen all the very best in what you're doing. And I will definitely be looking to buy Guidebook 4. <laughs> <laughs> As we're on the top of the Pyrenees with these Dutch people. All right. Yeah. Best of luck.